Could be a crocodile. Or an iguana. Blame the taxidermist. I'm the most important person, um, creature, in this painting. You see, just by hanging here, people know that this is an alchemist's laboratory. Yeah, I've seen it all. See the guy in the bottom right with the bellows? He's the alchemist. The furnace to his right, he uses that for distilling stuff. He's made aqua vita, which you might call alcohol. And just so you know, my alchemist is not interested in making gold. He'd rather make medicines. See that hourglass by his feet? That's so he can properly time what he's doing. He doesn't want to end up with arsenic when he's trying for antimony. That can make all the difference between sludge and something that will help people. Oh, you're a painter? Well, my alchemist can make the pigments for you. He makes the best and brightest red vermilion for all the painters around here. The assistant with the mortar and pestle? He's probably grinding your pigments right now. Of course, sometimes he blows things up. Singed my skin a few times. He's looking a bit worried now. Maybe he's remembering the time he distilled vitriol to make oil of vitriol. That's sulfuric acid to you. And it all went wrong. The place smelled like a warthog farted. That smell was nothing compared to the time he made phosphorus. That was a stink, with all the barrels of pee he needed to make the stuff cluttering up the place. Now that guy at the back, holding up the flask? He sometimes treats sick people. Oh, you're wondering about all the glassware? Well, my alchemist blows all his own glassware. His glass hardly ever breaks. I only have a few slivers in my hide. Some of the other alchemists, you don't want to be anywhere near when their glass hits the heat. You think it's all peaceful here? Well, see that little cat by the forge? In a minute, she's going to jump on the dog. He'll start yapping and knock over something. Then you'll really see what a mess this place can get into. Better get going before the cat-dog alchemy disaster blows up. Drop by any time. I'll still be here.